Greetings and welcome to a new video. I hope you are all doing well. So guys, you asked for it and here is a complete guide on how to install Troll Store 2 on all your ARM64 or A11 and lower devices without installing a proper jailbreak and using SSH right on your Windows PC natively. The method shown in this video along with Troll Store 2 or any other tools we use are completely free and legit before we begin let's talk about the advantages and how it will work so it will work on all your arm 64 devices your a11 and lower devices but if you are on ios 16.6.1 and lower or ios 17.0 it will also survive a reboot so if you reboot your device after installing troll store 2 on these versions 16.6.1 and lower and 17.0 the troll store will keep working even after a reboot all right also it will also be installed it can also be installed on any version for example ios 16.7.4 but as you know, Trollstore 2 is not supported on this version. The Trollstore 2 will stop working if you reboot your device. So you will have to use WinRain to simply kick start it and it will start working again. Now, let's talk about advantages. So you won't have any jailbreak detection in apps. All your apps will work because it will not be a jailbreak but we will be using ssh so you can easily use any app without any jailbreak detection second thing is you will be able to set a passcode on all your a11 devices if you are on a version supported by troll store for example 16.6.1 and lower or 17.0 and the third thing is again it will survive a reboot if you are on a troll store 2 supported ios version i hope it is clear now let's talk about what's required for this method to work so first of all you will need troll store 2 persistence helper underscore embedded i will show you how to get it and in tools you will need first of all 3u tools to get ssh working and win s cp to get into the file system and you will also need winrain to start the ssh on your device don't worry we will not be installing a Celio or a proper jailbreak but winrain is only used to start ssh now let's first of all collect all the required tools now you can head to the official github page for troll store scroll down and go to releases and here you will find the persistence helper underscore embedded file so get it from here all right i already got it next get three u tools from its official website as you can see it right here it is again completely free and for win scp get it from its official website as you can see it right here it is again also completely free also you will need itunes so get itunes from the official apple's website scroll down and get it for your windows pc please don't install it using the microsoft store install it directly using the windows link lastly you need winrain i will attach a link to the winrain's package in the description or in the pinned command or i will link everything in a text file all right so you will be able to get them easily don't worry all right so once you have all these three tools win scp and troll store 2 now simply install three tools first then install win scp and of course install itunes once these are installed open winrain and simply connect your ios device via usb and hit trust and it will show up on a winrain again we will not be installing a complete jailbreak but we will be using winrain just to get ssh working all right you can use 
the rootless mode it will work without any issues before hitting next if you are on a11 device and you are on ios 16 please remove the passcode by going to settings and disable it also if you have disabled it you will also have to go to general scroll all the way down back up your device then reset your device erase all content and settings or the jailbreak or wind rain will not work and the device will panic all right once done you can hit next this is the same dialog that i have told you to disable passcode and erase all content and settings hit ok and the device will go into recovery mode hit start and get it to dfu and let the process complete all right so i am not cutting this video from here so that you can see that it works and we did not encounter any errors so my device is now booting and you can see all done so the process is complete also if you see any error i recommend installing usb dk and restarting your computer once and it will work also as you can see my device booted up and i have the pailrain loader so it means that we have the ssh now working you can see that my device is now connected in check rain mode so it means everything is working fine now now the very next thing is to open 3u tools and head to the toolbox section and you can see i did not install Celio and everything all right now just hit open ssh and now it is open now please note you will have to type this 127.0.0.1 and port is 22 the default id is root and the password is alpine a l p i n e now open win scp as i told it is completely free and you can see my device i did not install Celio. so now in file protocol select scp in host name 127.0.0.1 and power is 22 username is root password is a l p i n e and login just hit update and you are good to go you can see we are in device now now you can see we have troll store 2 so select it from here and get to the directory where you have what the troll store 2 persistence helper underscore embedded all right now in root go to root and then go to var then go to containers then go to bundle then go to application and please don't worry you will see these random folders from here select any folder for the apps you want to make the troll store helper if you keep searching you will find tips for example you can make any app like home a troll store helper it's your choice so for example now we are in so just select it for example this is tips and you will see we have the tips binary so simply rename the persistence helper to the app you want to make the troll store helper so i will simply rename it to tips all right and then simply drag and drop it onto the folder also before we replace you can see that tips is the original tips app and it is working now let's simply drag and drop it here and then hit yes now if i check my device you can see tips is now the troll store helper so we did it correctly now make sure wi-fi is connected on your device and then hit install troll store so it is now being installed all right so it is now installed open it 
and it will automatically install Elden. And now you are good to go. Now you can simply install a persistence helper. Go to settings, install persistence helper. Select tips, it is okay to do it. All right, so now it is set, you can see. Tips is now the persistence helper. And you can see the version 2.0.8 and everything is working just fine without any issues. Now, as I said earlier that if you are on any supported Troll Store 2 version 16.6.1 and lower or 17.0, it will also survive a reboot. So if you reboot your device and turn it back on, Troll Store will still work. But if you are on an iOS version which is unsupported by Trollso 2, you will simply have to connect your device to WinRain and then simply jailbreak it or you can say you can simply kickstart and then Trollso 2 will again start working. Now to show you that there is no jailbreak detection in any app because we haven't installed a proper jailbreak. I will go to App Store, install this Jazz World, which I know that does not work while I am jailbroken. So let's quickly install it. All right, as you can see, it is now being installed. All right, it is now installed. Let's test it. So as you can see, it is working just fine without any issues. So there is no jailbreak detection in any app which do not work while you are jailbroken. Now just to show you that Troll Store works, I will install Misaka which I have got right now. Install it and I will show you that it works installed. Let's open it and you can see that any app you install using this Troll Store to will work without any issues we don't have any problems whatsoever also in the end you can remove the pale rain loader from your home screen to make it look better because we don't need it because we already installed troll store 2 and you can see it is all working just fine that's all for this video guys if you still have issues please type it in the comment and ask me. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care.